All right, we're getting started on the shower today. Got some tile for the bench already cut and kind of laid out like I want it. Got my, I don't know what you call it, ledge board in. That's where I'm gonna start, come up the walls. Just mixed up the batch of thin set. We're getting her ready to go. All right, it's on mission time. I got a little bit done. It's hard to see, I came back up on this thing. Anyway, I got the bench laid. I got around, part way, part way around three walls here. And uh, I was running out of time on my thin set. It's starting to set up pretty good and wouldn't spread on the wall or the tile. And I decided it was time to take a break and go eat lunch. Plus, I'm at a point where I need to make a bunch of cuts. I need to cut, where's my finger? I need to cut that piece there, which is a little complicated. I need to go find my hole saw to cut those two. Over here, I need to make, you know, cut these couple of pieces, three pieces there. But once I get all those cut or whatever, and then I mix up another batch of thin set and I can go to town after that. But right now I gotta go to town and go eat. I'm hungry. Talk to you in a little bit. All right, well, working on the tile here. We got a, uh, came up and figured out I was gonna use, where's my finger? I was gonna use this trim in here. Just clean it up a little bit. I'm gonna use it there too. I don't know if I filmed that I found the granite or not. But anyway, I got, I got a bunch of pieces of these little remnants or whatever. I cut them off to size and I got the grinder and a, a polishing wheels. I'm gonna have to clean those and polish them, these edges here. Get them installed. And we decided I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and tile the outside of the whole shower. I think I'll just look better. So that's what we're working on now. Got everything done on the inside. I wish that I had decided to use this trim pieces. I wish I had got one for here on the bench. But that doesn't look too bad. It's it, it'll be fine. But anyway, that's what we got going on today. Got to a stopping point here with these got to be ripped there of course the bottom we're doing the same as we did on the inside because i want the lines to match coming around and the way it falls out just so happens to be that i'm gonna be about the bottom piece a full piece will fit in there but it's i'm gonna be about a half inch short of going all the way to the floor with it, which would be fine. The time I put floor in and then we'll trim it out and it'll be fine. But anyway, we got this. I kind of, I'm gonna have to rip these pieces and cut them in there. And then we need to, I'm gonna do across this way, each piece through there and here. And then I've got somewhere a granite piece for here too. But it's coming along. It'll be done in no time. All right, we are getting ready to lay the last of the tile and the granite. Got them all polished up, cut the right size, polished the edges. Had 
had to go in and polish or we polish these edges where I cut them. This edge and that one. And then putting a piece over here. Same deal. Anyway, just mixed up some thin set. It's ready to go. I'm gonna lay it all down. Tomorrow we grout. All right, we got the tile all laid, got the granite laid, got everything grouted almost. A couple of little spots I missed, but I've been wiping it off or whatever, cleaning it up. It still needed a couple more times. I was playing with the, this is the faucet fits one, the shower head and all that exposed plumbing. Going right, going to be right there. But I was messing with that dry fitting it, which I'd done before, whatever, to get my depth for the, whatever you call the little things that go in the wall in there. Elbows from the water lines going up and then. But yeah, it's looking pretty good. Like I said, need to clean it up some more or whatever and then we'll get it cleaned off again a couple of times in the morning and then we'll caulk everything. All the edges are all gonna be caulked around the base. If you grout those or whatever, you get any kind of movement at all in that crack. You grout or crack. So I've always caught them. But anyway, we'll get that cleaned up, finish cleaning it up and caulked tomorrow and then we'll put the faucet, the shower head in. Pull a little Plastic cover off the drain. And then we'll, I need to touch up a couple of spots of grout. And get that cleaned up and then once that dries, we'll seal all the, seal the grout lines. This grout says you don't need to or that you don't have to seal it, but I will anyway, just because. But yeah, it looks pretty good. I'm liking it. The end is near. All right, so got it all finished, got it all cocked up late last night. Let it dry overnight, let the caulk dry overnight, and then I just turn the water on this uh, shower. The water feed in here, there's valves They're on the back side of the wall, or they're inside the wall, but there's I access it from behind to turn the water lines on, which we just did, and I just run it, check everything out. I don't see any leaks anywhere, none on the supply. I don't, I don't see any on the drain, can't really see anything. But look to the holes in the floor that we got attached. But, Basically, the shower is done. I'm glad to have it done. Might get those lights in up there or whatever and figure out what I'm doing there. But there's a, two switches here. I'll get different switch plates at some point. Run those two up there. That's, uh, there'll be a light in a fan there but yeah the shower is done and that all works i checked it all out the rain shower and then the hose and it works just right or whatever you, you know it's got a diverter on it and you can divert to the 
handheld, but there's a mount for it right there, and it works just right. You can use that one also to shower, and it's just right. But I tell you what, I'm glad to be done with this. And now we'll move on to, I don't know if they're bigger or better or whatever, but we'll move on to other things. And the next item up for bid is, I need to order floors. I think we've decided on the floors that we're gonna put in and uh, I need to get them ordered get them coming and then I need to do at least I need to do that wall right there because the next thing is I'm going to get this I got the faucets and everything for the claw foot tub but I've got to get like I said I got to get this wall at least that wall done and then the floor which I'll just do the whole floor and the whole bedroom here because this four foot tub is going right there centered under the window and it'll be right here and it's it juts out just a couple of inches or whatever but the end of it is you know rounded and it's it's not like it's going to be blocking the shower door it juts out just a little bit but it's rounded and it'll be fine but anyway that's the the drains are all there. I've got the drains moved, the water lines moved over there. And uh, I've got to get the wall done and then the floor. And I move the tub over there where it goes. And then that joker is the vanity, which I've ordered the at the same time, I ordered the, the cloth foot tub faucets and stuff. I ordered a faucet for the vanity, which it hadn't come in yet. But I need to order a sink. Can't decide on a sink that we want, so I need to get that coming in. And this vanity, I'm going to do a drop in sink on here because and i think i'm gonna take the wheels off the legs here because this is going to be if we did a vessel sink above but it's just going to be too high for a vanity so we can drop it down two inches with taking the wheels off and then cut you know we'll cut coal in here or whatever and gut all this inside but uh we'll cut a hole here and mount the uh, mount the faucet and all that and you know put a drop in the sink there and then that is going basically where that mirror is that's that vanity will be right there and we'll take the mirror off and what I'll do when I redo the wall but that's the drain for the sink right there and that's the vent that goes up the wall but yeah Get the floor in here done, get the wall right there, and I guess I need to do that wall too. We'll get the cloth foot tub over here, get the sink ordered, and get the vanity here, and then we'll need to get a toilet that goes in there. And then, you know, like I said, we'll figure out the rest of the walls here and, and get that going and the bedroom will be done but yeah this is a this shower has been kicking my butt I just hit it so much of it or whatever I have to you know have to work on it all day or whatever to get anything done and I just haven't had the haven't had the opportun opportunity to spend all day on it I mean, anyway I got was off for the most part Friday and was able to work on it all the weekend straight through and got to finish up whatever my goal you know my goal was to have it up and running by now by today and 
It's up and running. But anyway, that's... Filming with my iPad and it, it zoomed out all the way and it's, I can't get it far enough away from it. But yeah, that's the deal. On to bigger and better things. Like that monster. <laughs> See y'all later.